Hey everybody, welcome to episode number 10 of What's That Pepper series. Today, I have another interesting pot to show you. This is a cross of my own, Scotch bonnet yellow, crossed with a Brazilian ghost red. Uh, I've done another one previously of the same variety, but that was a red variety. This is a yellow. So, let's go take a look at the plant, both of them, and then we'll come back and I'll show you what this pepper looked like inside. All right, here's a look at my plant. These two plants here are my personal cross from the same pods. I collected seeds out and grew them, and one is red and the other one is yellow. The plants are very nice looking. It's very small right now, but it can grow up to four to five feet tall because the parent plants are that large. Let's take a closer look at the red pod. Very beautiful. And then the yellow pot, exactly same features, except this one is yellow and the other one is red. Okay, here's what the yellow scotch bonnet crossed with the Brazilian ghost look like. It's a very beautiful pod. If you go back to my previous review video I have done one already the red variety I grew these from the same seeds that I took out of the same pods and one turned red and one turned yellow as you can see the features are very much the same except the color so before I cut it open let me show you what the parent plants look like these are scotch bonnet yellow the parent beautiful pods these has really good flavor nice aroma good sweetness and pretty good heat and these are quite small but they can get a little bit larger than that and here is the other parent which is the Brazilian ghost these are extremely hot rated at 1.4 million up there and uh, these are semi ripened when they're completely ripened they turn this color the variety is not stable so you get all kinds of different shapes sometimes they look like a scorpion with a stinger and um, sometimes they look like this but very, very beautiful plants and they produce well. Also very spicy. Okay, let's cut this open and we'll give it a taste. Okay, here's what the pepper looked like inside. The wall is very thin. For a small pot, this is, has a lot of seeds. So let's give it a smell. Wow, it smells very fruity and sweet and uh, has that Chenin smell. I just love the smell of Scotch Bonnet and this is very much like that. Mm, I, I really love the smell. Okay, let's cut a piece out and we'll try it. I don't know how hot this is, but I'm not going to try to risk it. So let's just take a small piece. No, not much placenta in there, so it would not be as hot as the section over here. Okay, Scotch bonnet yellow crossed with a Brazilian ghost red. Let's give it a taste. Very crunchy. This is, oh, whew. it's not very sweet. It tastes just like the, the red variety that I just did a review for. Very hot, a little bit of sweetness, not too much. But there's, there's like a real quick heat that just started attacking your tongue as soon as you, the juice start flowing. And when you swallow the heat all over here, Wow, it's, it's still, still kicking, it's building. It hit quickly. It's kind of lingering around here, but I don't feel anything at the top of my tongue. Still in the back of the throat. Very good heat. Yeah, it's still there. 
very good aroma but the sweetness is not as sweet as the the parent plant these are much sweeter also it has more juice because the the walls are thicker wow this thing is still around man this is it's very hot I would say if you eat the whole thing it could be very very spicy wow it's just not going away Whoa. a little bit probably much hotter than the red one that I've done already it's still in my throat Wow, the heat is very similar to the Brazilian ghost. I guess I took them a, a little bit bigger piece than normal. Man, it's still lingering. Usually it will just die off already, but it's still here. <clears throat> Whew. Okay it's starting to subside now so wow I just took a very small piece too I was expecting it not to be this hot because the walls are so thin I guess because the placenta run down to the very tip of the pot when I cut that piece off there's still some of it in there so that's where all the spice is definitely good heat Whew, immediate heat not a lot of juice not very sweet I actually left this on the plant longer to, to, to see if it would get sweeter too so both of the cross the red and the yellow are not as sweet as the parent but this one does definitely have the heat of the the parent red Brazilian ghost yeah well, I'll be growing this for sure to see what else would come of this, but um, not bad variety. Um, it looks very pretty, very smooth skin, uh, kind of wrinkly at the tip here. Resemble the parent plant, which is uh, this little wrinkly thing here. And the smoothness of this is from the Scotch bonnet. So it's a very good mixture of... Uh, um, decent uh, sweetness the same kind of smell and aroma but very very good heat that kicks immediately just like the Brazilian ghost so uh, yeah that's it uh, again I will be growing these out and uh, trying to stabilize it maybe I'll get it to F4 or F5 and I'll share seeds with people Anyway, that's all for this video. Um, I hope you liked the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching.